so I'll just give you a brief run through on the history, at least from my perspective, from what I've understood of it. Capoeira was born in Africa, but raised in Brazil. And then during the, the slave trade, you know, to the New World, African slaves kept hold of this. They practiced it to keep up their fighting skills. When you're in a game and somebody throws a habija high at you, you have to react to it. And it's the same thing with a conversation. If somebody says something to you, you have to accept it and allow them to see their viewpoint, but still maintain your own and kind of explain to them why you think you do. The conversation you have with the person you're playing with may, may be rough. Um, it can be an argument, but it's still a conversation. It's a way for you to express yourself. I used to, you know, try to hold back from saying something too straightforward because I, you know, I wouldn't want to hurt anybody's feelings. So I feel like now I, I'm more inclined to just put my opinion out there and then just defend it as necessary. It's philosophy, I think, is maybe what I like about it most. Things happen and it all depends on how you react to it. Some people are very smooth and alert. Some people are very playful. There are some who are really nice. And others who are really flashy and, you know, do a lot of big energy moves. But all these things just reflect how the person is in, in life.